refer to our recent announcement regarding EM solutions. This transaction represents an important step in the evolution of EOS and provides the ability to recycle capital into opportunities aligned with EOS core competencies and high growth markets, specifically the counter drone market. Drones have been around for 20 years. Every year they get smaller, cheaper to make and more lethal. I would like today to outline why we see this as a compelling opportunity for EOS. The recent introduction of these smaller drones to the battle space represents the most significant disruption to warfare seen in decades. The low-cost nature of these drones has created an asymmetric scenario, enabling otherwise less powerful adversaries to project considerable power. Almost overnight, military assets and critical infrastructure worth hundreds of millions of US dollars are now at risk of being destroyed or disrupted by weapons costing merely thousands. The new battlefield paradigm has now shifted. It has shifted towards distributed, scalable systems rather than centralized, heavily fortified assets. The low cost of drones enables adversaries to deploy swarms of tens or even hundreds or even more, even thousands of drones capable of overwhelming traditional air defense systems. In the Ukraine-Russia conflict, it is estimated that each side is producing more than a million drones per year. This threat will be further compounded by the rise of autonomous systems and artificial intelligence. The traditional military-industrial complex is not able to adapt quickly to such sudden market shifts in warfare and has been slow to respond to this evolving threat. Smaller, more agile and innovative enterprises are increasingly filling up this gap. While many companies focus on drone warfare, where barriers to entry are low, fewer companies specialize in counter-drone solutions. This is due to the formidable technical challenges. Initially, soft kill solutions such as electronic warfare, for example jamming, were seen as the answer to the drone threat. However, the Ukraine-Russia conflict has demonstrated that these solutions are losing effectiveness as drones incorporate radiation shielding and autonomous guidance systems. While electronic warfare will remain a part of the counter-drone arsenal, it is increasingly recognized that kinetic and high-energy laser systems are key to defending this threat. Standing back from this, the drivers are very clear. Reducing cost of drones, increasing lethality and the role of AI in making swarm attacks. These market drivers are not short-term. They are likely to grow as the global geopolitical situation and technology continue to evolve rapidly. This enduring growth theme is why we believe it is the right time for EOS to focus on this market opportunity. With a strong heritage in kinetic systems, such as our cannon-based remote weapon systems, as well as our cutting-edge high-energy laser weapon technology, EOS is in a great position to be able to capture this significant opportunity. We look forward to growing our business and invite you to join us.